Hey, welcome to the channel. Today I'm about to check out Long Beach Griffey when the song is too relatable. There are many, many, many tracks out there for everybody to listen to and there's always that few that hit like hit and you don't always have to be depressed you don't even have to be depressed for a song to relate you could just be chilling listening and you're like oh shit oh oh wow this is actually relatable to me this is a, a topic that i've been through i've experienced type of thing and it's like wow i can actually properly relate to this artist and then you start following that artist but yeah that's why i saw it's just I don't know, they just feel better, like, knowing that someone is going through what you're going through. It just feels like, damn, finally, I know somebody out there who understand me, but more or less, they're just writing the song from them for themselves. Maybe sometimes it's for you, but most of the time, it's about themselves, their health, their this, their that, their past, their pain, their sorrow, their happiness, their joy. You just think it's about you, or you just relate to it. So, it's just easier, even though, I'm sorry, they're not even thinking about you right now when writing that song. So, yeah, with that said... Uh, if you enjoyed the video, like, comment, share, subscribe. Let me know that. Fuck. Fuck. Ah! Ah! I had a whole script. Let me, uh... Okay, I'm just playing. I'm just playing. There's no script. But if you enjoyed the video, like, comment, share, subscribe. Let me know what video to check out. And I'm gonna do so. But for now, let's see how relatable... Which song would he pick? Which song would Griffy pick for him to be relatable? Hmm, let me think of a dude that's iffy. Which song matches... Fuck. Which song matches Griffy? Mm. Or oh, which artist? Let's just say artist. I don't know, Weird Al Yankovic. I don't know what the type of humor he be doing, but Hobson maybe Hobson. Um, that's as that's as far as I could think. So I'm um, without trying to push time. So yeah. With that said, if you enjoyed the video, like I said before, now let's see how relatable this song is. Maybe he might rap or make one up, or he might use his past videos, the school shooter. Um in the studio raises in the studio type of ish like that so with that said let's see what song relatable to griffy <laughs> what griffy dark days <laughs> all right i know you feeling down but you're gonna be okay it ain't a bad life my nigga just a bad day you want to give up based on all that you've been through but you gotta keep fighting like Street Fighter Ryu. <laughs> what? Oh, uh, nah, nah. Okay, no, that that's just a little coincidence, right? Those first lines are just a, just a little coincidence. It all. ain't a bad life, my nigga. Just a bad day. Mm. You wanna give up based on all that you've been through? But you gotta keep fighting like Street Fighter Ryu. Rindu, and you can barely pay that. Seven eighty two thirty five to be exact. Whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> <laughs> whoa whoa bro he even got the year down he got the year down of the game now okay now that's it's a little suspicious but may, maybe you could let that one slide a little bit you can let that Based slide all that you've been through but you gotta keep, keep fighting, fighting like street fighter ryu rindu and you can barely pay that 782 35 to be exact take off your headphone somebody knocking at the door it's your nigga try to say he back from the store what what? Hey, bro, I'm back from the store. What? <laughs> nah, 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 nah. That he's on his um Aaron Yeager shit, knowing ish before it happened because he caused it to happen back in the day. Wait a minute. Do you think that Aaron made his dad meet his mom to clap it up? and make that son and made sure when they ass was done they moved to place now on the run okay okay i, I fumbled it there so did he, he why she's just for the greater good of his plan you know just to let you know i right. Now I know you sick and tired, you tired of stressing about Got your pockets out, they empty, they in a drought But I promise suicide is not the route Even if your wife is <laughs> wait. wait, where did the blick come from? I ain't see bro sit with it bro Now I'm talking about he ate Yo! So what, he was contemplating that Okay, no, people contemplate shit like that at their own time now So I know you sick and tired, can't you tired be judgmental of that about. 
Got your pockets out, they empty, they in a drought. Uh. But I promise suicide is not the route. Even if your wife is cheating in the same house, head high, can you overcome every issue? <laughs> God bless you. <laughs> nah. Nah, at that point, at that point, bro, I'm looking out the windows. But why would that help? You already dropped the song. Bro, the Aaron wrote this, bro. Aaron wrote this. You need a tissue? I think you need a tissue. Uh. He ain't nothing but a gap to nigga. Ball head nigga. Fat ass nigga. So now he about to load it up and pull the fucking trigger. Uh. He ain't got nothing. He a sad ass nigga. <laughs> he ain't nothing but a weak ass nigga. Hey. My life ain't right so I'm about to end it. I'm a fucking cry and give up because of my life is hard. You a bitch ass nigga. Go lose some weight you fat fuck. Go lose some weight, nigga. Go lose some weight. Get in your bag, you broke bitch. Do do what you gotta do, nigga. Stop fucking crying. Get get stand up. Get your bitch ass out there and actually fucking work for some shit. Yeah. Bad ass, pussy ass, dumb fuck. Yeah. But yeah, on some real shit, bro. Like, yeah. Okay. Uh, yeah. That that's how she go, bro. Like instead of trying, like for some people they're in there too deep, but I don't think. Or suggest that that should be the way to go, the way to take. Because if I'm being honest, YouTube, like me posting YouTube videos, is a coping mechanism for me. Because shit happens. That's all I can say. Shit happens. And the more I post videos, the more consistent I am. As sad as it is, the more consistent I am, it's just me trying to make myself happy. Because as soon as the camera's on, the, the video records, I see the views, I see the likes, I see a couple of the comments. That shit just brings a smile to my face. Me entertaining you... Or entertaining a few people that if my content is just enough for me to make me happy type of thing. So yeah, people be like, hey yo man, that's kinda sad. You've uploaded like 500 plus videos, so I'm worried about you if this is why because like yes, for I'm not gonna do a percentage because people are gonna be like, that's fucking depressing, man. You you need help. Bro, this is my therapy, this is my coping mechanism. YouTube just I don't know, just uploading videos just makes me happy that's all it is it, it, i don't know that's all it is so yeah i wouldn't suggest taking that route do i see myself taking that route and youtube is preventing that from happening because i don't want all this work to go to waste so yeah i feel like once this all of this goes to waste pew, i think i should say i'm joking i'm i'm joking are you okay? Are you happy? Alright, cool. Sit. So yeah, with that said, man, if you enjoyed the video, like, comment, share, subscribe. Nah, that was a sad outro. But it's not really sad. It's happy. I'm still happy. I'm smiling. You know, jeez, all of that. So yeah, with that said, if you enjoyed the video, like, comment, share, subscribe. Let me know which video to check out. And I'm going to do so. But for now, I'm going to see you guys. Don't be a weak ad, dummy ad, chuffin' ass, bitch made um, um, person. So yeah.